Rigid body drag works in the same way just like air resistance in real life. So you will notice that currently the drag value is 0 and I am going to hit on the play button. So you will notice that the cube falls down. Now I am going to increase the drag and hit on the play button again. You will notice that the cube falls down very slowly. This is because the drag or the air resistance always acts in the opposite direction to the movement of a rigid body. So if you are moving a rigid body upward then the drag will act in the downward direction. Similarly in this situation the gravity force is trying to move the this particular cube downward that's why the drag is acting in the upward direction. So eventually the combined forces of the drag and the gravity in this case makes the cube move slower because our drag's value is higher. If the drag value is lower, it's easier for the gravity force to pull down this particular cube. So this is what drag does in rigid body.